this time to visit the other set of grandparents I have who live in Michigan. So we're hoping to do some geocaching in Michigan. Of course I'll video all of that. But yeah, today we are going to show you America, still over America of Tennessee, Kentucky, Ohio, and Michigan. Also hoping to do a little interstate caching.
Hey everyone, Geocaster Team and Photobug here. A little update. We are in Kentucky as you probably saw a few scenes ago. We are just off exit 38 in London, Kentucky. Just doing a little stop here quick and um, then we'll get back on the road. It's going very well so far today. The rain has stopped. Yay, yay. And um, yeah, just enjoying seeing America. everyone, this is Geocaster T and Photobug. We are now in Lexington, Kentucky. About 10.20 in the morning, everything's going really well. And glad to be in Lexington, another check off the map. There you go for your update. Okay, welcome to the rest area just north of Georgetown, Kentucky. We are stopping, first rest stop area of the day. We're going to try to stretch our legs and uh, maybe even find a cashew. Hey everybody, we just found that cache. It is, I believe, GC16M0T. Very good additional hints and uh, clues in the main description. Found it, signed my name. Really exciting. And I um, just want to say a few more things. Um, I said I did really like that cache. Good clues and very easy to find. Just even just with the additional hint and quickly looking on the um, cache description page last night. Um, we were actually looking in the wrong place about 20 or 30 feet away. But I checked my GPS, went to where it said zero feet. And there it was. My dad spotted it very quickly. So I'm very glad I was able to find it and um, get a, my first... Kentucky 2012 cash because I did find a few last year but glad to find first cash on this trip and um, yeah so just I'm really happy about that a lot of fun and um, we will continue keeping on well you will get back onto I-75 shortly
welcome to Cincinnati. We will shortly be in Cincinnati proper and the great grand state of Ohio. Welcome everybody to Dayton, Ohio. It is approximately 1.15 in the afternoon. And a um, little detail on Dayton. If you don't remember, Dayton is the home of the Wright brothers where Orville and Wilbur Wright grew up. And um, oh, last year, when my family and I came on our Michigan vacation, we took a little side trip to Dayton and visited the National Museum of the United States Air Force here in Dayton. It is a completely free museum run by the Air Force and it's just a museum of all things flight and history and planes all the way from the Wrights and even before to the most advanced spy planes, rockets, spacecraft, you name it, they have it. Of course focusing on the Air Force's role in flight but still very interesting and I don't know if I mentioned but it is free. Um, really really cool spot. Bicentennial 1803 to 2003. We are now in um, corn country. Corn on seems like every side of the highway right here, except right now where there's trees. It is 2:13 p.m. We just passed the town of Wapakoneta, Ohio. And um, it is the hometown of Neil Armstrong, the first man on the moon. And um, last year, when same trip that my parents and I, family and I did our side trip to Dayton at the Air Force Museum, we also visited the Armstrong Air and Space Museum in Wapakoneta. Really cool museum, highly recommend it. There is the real Gemini 8 spacecraft that Neil Armstrong commanded on his very first flight into space before Apollo 11, as well as a plane he flew, a backup, a backup suit that he wore, 
a um, um, some moon rocks, some uh, sh real shuttle tire, some simulators, a little movie, just really really cool place to go. Um, anyway, last year was like just days before challenges were even invented and released, and so of course I couldn't co couldn't complete any challenges then. Um, but since then, there's been a challenge created at that museum to get a, a part of your body, your foot, on the moon, or the, your hand on the moon. I should explain that. Um, the museum is shaped like, an air, like a moon base, and the middle part is shaped to look like a moon. There's actually a little theater in there, but um, anyway, you want to try to get your hand or foot on the moon. And um, I think the challenge creator meant for you to actually be on museum property and get your picture of your hand or foot on the moon but um he, they didn't say that you couldn't do it from the freeway and since I have been there uh, to the museum before I decided to try to get a picture of my my finger on the moon as we we traveled by at 70 miles an hour so my sister helped me she put up her finger I put up my finger I snapped a shot and we do have our fingers on the moon on at the museum so that was kind of cool Hey everyone, it's Geocache Tan Photobug, about 3.24 um, today. We are about two mile, two or three miles away from the town of Bowling Green, Ohio. It's been going really well, our trip. Just enjoying, just getting the miles behind us. And hey everyone, it's about 3.50 in the afternoon. We are now stuck in Toledo. Traffic's going a little slow. We are tantalizingly close to the Michigan border, but um, hopefully we'll get through this soon and show you some footage of us crossing into Michigan. Welcome to Michigan! At 4 o'clock in the afternoon, our family has entered our destination state of Michigan. Yip yip hooray, or hip hip hooray. Hey everyone, this is Geocacher TN Photobug. It is about 5.13 in the evening. We just got off 23 off of onto exit 67 and hopefully we'll be at my grandma and grandpa's house soon. Yay! Everybody, we are. Uh, let's see. It's 5:28 in the evening. We are. I'm um, getting closer to my my grand grandpa's house. Um, I think I'm going to shut off this camera here. But um, thank you for coming along with me, watching this video as I see America, or at least the states of Tennessee, Kentucky, Ohio, and Michigan. And so, um, if you want to learn anything more about this video. 
or anything history or geocaching oriented, please be sure to check out my blog at www.historicalgeocaching.blogspot.com. And yeah, be on the lookout for more videos, uh, more videos for my Michigan trip coming soon. So yeah, thank you for coming along, and this is Geocaster TN Fudbug signing out. I'm having a blast with the past.